When making games, it's very important to allocate your time to focus on what you're best at. And for that reason, the Unity Asset Store is a fantastic resource to use for finding assets you don't have the time to make. And this gives you more time to focus on your main strength, whether that is game design, art, programming, or another development discipline. So in this video, we're going to take a look at five great assets for your mobile game and see how they can ease the development process of your project. We're also going to leave links to each asset we mention in the description box of this video so that you can easily find them. So without further ado, let's get started. The first asset we'll check out is called Easy Mobile Pro. Easy Mobile Pro is made by SGLIB Games and it's a many in one package that greatly simplifies the implementation of standard features of every mobile game. These features include implementing advertising, in-app purchasing, game services, notifications, sharing, and more. It's great to have common features like these in place so that you can work on the core of your game and avoid reinventing the wheel. As the name suggests, this is the pro version and there is a less expensive basic version too. There are some differences between the two which you can learn about on the asset page. Now moving on to the second asset, we're going to look at EUI, also called Easy UI Input. EUI is made by Renown Studio and it's a powerful and very easy to use system for processing UI element input. If you want to easily process data such as joystick access, button press, long press, or buttons being held, then this asset is ideal for you and will help to simplify your work. The main strength of this asset is that it's highly performant and supports many actions as well as many platforms. And at number three, we have an asset called Cool Joystick. Cool Joystick is a pack of joysticks to add a unique touch to your game and save you time when working on the controller mechanics. This is made by White Anvil Studio and has 42 setup prefabs and scenes to demonstrate how different joysticks can be used for various mobile games. The asset shines with its main features such as editing in real time using a configuration file, updates with screen size and rotation, access constraints, functions to work as a touchpad, variable numbers of joysticks on screen at once, and more. It's very easy to use thanks to being so well organized and documented. And moving on to number four, let's check out GameKit Controller. GameKit Controller is made by Two Cubes and it's a complete first and third person controller solution with sci-fi features such as zero gravity, astronaut, and free floating mode. GameKit Controller comes with a very powerful camera view system to cover almost any genre ranging from shooters, adventure, and action games to platformers and 2.5D games. It is highly customizable and very easy to set up. And now finally, moving on to the last asset, at number 5 we're going to look at Rome Mobile Fantasy Pack. Rome Mobile Fantasy Pack is made by Quantum Theory and it's a Rome inspired 3D model pack. This pack derives from the desktop focused Rome Fantasy Pack asset and this mobile version is a texture atlas, low poly and highly optimized fantasy Roman themed environment pack. There are more than a hundred modular prefab meshes in this pack and tons of atlas props using LOD or level of detail in Unity which improves rendering performance. It's widely usable as you can paint special decals to add hay, damage and wetness to walls, floors and corners of buildings. And those are our five great assets for making mobile games in Unity. If you have your own favorites, make sure to leave a comment on this video stating which ones you have used and which ones are your favorites. And again, just a reminder, we're going to leave links to each asset we mentioned in the description box of this video, so make sure to check them out. So with that being said, we hope you enjoyed watching and found learning about these assets useful. We look forward to seeing your comments on this video and to see you in the next video too. So thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next one.